so me and Clay, wherever Clay is, um, we're going to go with my dad and my grandfather, and we're headed to Bass Pro Shops. I gotta get a new reel because I left my rod and reel at the boat ramp the other day. Um, in another video that you're gonna see in a couple of days, hopefully. So I gotta get a new reel because all I have right now is about a $15 like Bass Pro reel or something. So I gotta get a new reel, gotta get a new line, um, gotta get some baits, gotta get some information, and then we're gonna go smallmouth fishing. But we're in Tennessee now, so we're gonna see if we can catch some smallmouth. So we came to Bass Pro to get a reel because I lost mine the other day at the boat ramp and some lures and stuff like that. We get in there, they're sold out of any kind of reel that's a good deal. So, no reel. And then we go to get some chatter baits that were on sale. And as we're getting chatter baits off the rack, the guy comes and pulls all the sale signs off of them. So we're leaving Bass Pro empty handed. And I'm using like a six pound test reel with no, like with no drag on it. So we'll see how we can do on some smallmouth. I had nothing going on hard enough. I got one hit right in here somewhere. Uh oh. That might be a fish right there. Oh. You got him. Yes. First Molly ever, guys. Oh, I want to land this thing so bad. Guys, that's my first smallmouth ever. Big carp. Yeah. I don't know what it is, but it's a little guy. Subscribers and show them the call. Alright guys, Clay's got one. A little bit bigger than mine it looks like. Oh, that's a nice one, Clay. Hold it off a little bit farther. Is 